What's up, guys? It's your King Knight. It's about time you exterk my arch fiends. And, well, I got a subject and advice video for you guys, most likely. If I can say that on my camera thing. But nonetheless, I'm getting ready to go to the dollar store. Got off work really early because well, I want to join my Tuesday so I can go to, you know, Tap K later on. So, I'm just going to be doing some home decor stuff right now. But nonetheless... I got this subject concerns all of us as geeks, gamers, and all of this stuff, and real gamer girls. To the white knights who keep atrociously defending these fake female streamers, you know who I'm talking about. The ones who purposely say controversial stuff and try to be all edgy. Like, I don't know, Legendary Leah, for an example. Stop defending these type of females. They don't care about you. They don't want you around. I mean, they want you to defend their honor, but they ain't going to ever notice you. They ain't going to ever notice you. You might as well go to Comic-Con, hook up with a real with a real girl gamer, girl nerd, that really appreciates the nerd culture and appreciates you for you, instead of these fake hussies who's trying to make a quick dollar off of you. Stop doing that. If you want to go for real girl gamers or real girl streamers, try to go for Highly a Suicide. She's genuine with everything. She doesn't push her Patreon on everybody else. And she makes fun of these fake game these fake streamers. <laughs> you know? Because all what these fake uh, female streamers do is say controversial stuff, shake their ass, shake their titties on camera, just to get you guys to donate. And they'll say controversial stuff. You know? Go for, I want you to go to Comic-Con and meet some real females. Planet Comic-Con's got plenty of females there. You don't need to subjugate yourself to these fake girl streamers that only going to use you. That's only going to sit there and take your money. You know? Now, I get some people do make a living off of Twitch. And you know what? To the real girl gamers <laughs> who get, you know, overshadowed by these, um, these, uh, the nice, I'm saying a nice way, these Twitch hoes, you girl gamers, you know, are getting overshadowed by these people, and that's not fair. I think real girl gamers should get credibility like everybody else, because these fake girl gamers out there, they're pretending to be somebody they're not, just to just to make a quick buck, and also ruining the female, ruining the female gamer community, which I feel sorry for good female gamers like Lady Hylia, who has to put up with these people's bullshit because then she gets labeled by by she gets labeled by society uh, labeled the same kind of label as all these other females out there that doing this so i'm just saying for you white knights won't you actually learn to pick a good side and won't you actually find a real girl at a comic con or whatever at a library bookstore instead of spending so much money and time Trying to hook up with these female, these fake female streamers. Just something to think about, you know. Something to think about. This is not about my emotions. This is just facts. <laughs> you white knights are the worst. Because you just keep defending something. Even when they act a fool. Like I remember when Legendary Leo said that um, if kids got cancer, they're supposed to die. Now what kind of fuck shit is that? What kind of fuck shit is that? You go and sit, sit there and say, Oh, she's just drunk. Or, she didn't mean it. She didn't mean it. She, the bitch put it on fucking camera. Even, I, even, even, even when I stream, I know when I'm wrong. Just like when I did the... Um, when I did the St. Patrick's Day Final Fantasy 15 stream, I did say some fucked up stuff. And I'm not going to lie. I'm going to own up to all that shit. Because I did say some pretty messed up stuff. These females don't want to have no responsibilities. They want people to keep saying that they can't help it. That they can't help it. Yes, they can. If you're an adult, you should know what you can and can't say online. Stop trying to defend these wannabe edgelord female streamers. Because all they're going to do is use you up. Why don't you go subscribe to real female streamers like Hylia Suicide. That's a, she's she's the only um, one of the one of the only female streamers that's genuine. You could talk to her. You could approach her. Don't waste your time with these fake female streamers.